other places that don't get as much attention, and we're not sure why. But, uh, you know, I think that that's, like, it's an important thing, like, where you are locally. I feel proud of where I was and where the town I was from. Uh, not even so much like the country or the state or whatever, I don't care about any of that. But, uh, except for when it comes to taxes, that's brutal. Um, um, I care about, like, where I'm from, like, my street and the street over from me and a couple streets of my neighbors, and, like, I care about that stuff because it's what I can focus on for me. Um, and so it felt good playing in that place again. And we played at the Stone Pony, which, you know, and, uh, so we went down there and we played and it was cool and then the president came in the next day or the day after the shows and uh, he was like, oh, we sold out shows that's so funny, but he didn't mention our name. <laughs> I was like, are you fucking kidding? <laughs> the president knows that we played and he, oh, you can't throw me a bone here. <laughs> so I was pretty bummed about that, but I was happy that, you know, people got their houses back. <laughs> Super bummed out. He's probably from the, he's from the streets. And he has a picture of, of the president in like this cabana hat when he was like 20 years old, and he's smoking a cigar. <laughs> I'm convinced. Like, can I go to jail for saying what I think? That thing? No, 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 no. Like, I know the Dixie Chicks. Like, people went fucking bananas when like they were like, we don't like our president. So what? You don't like your president. Nobody likes the president at that time. You know. But, uh, I'm probably gonna go home and like Eddie Vedder's gonna have to stick up for me, just like we're making the Dixie Chicks. You know, you know the one, you know the the one in the front. She might not be thin, but I like her. Now she's thin though. I don't like her. She looks like that way back. She looks better. I don't like her. She's too thin. Yeah, she's probably got a husband though. He'll be. That's my mom. That's my mom. Dude, your mom's smoking hot. That's awesome. Because you know what I learned by watching Psycho, that movie Psycho, is that your first nude woman is usually your mom that you see! Yeah. It's all good. My point, I had a point, but what my point was is I still think that certain people, I think he puffs away and pounds fist up and he's like, what's that? And then he does, because that's what I would do. You know Tom Cruise at the end of that, uh, that movie, Tropic Thunder, where he's like, I said, Brian Obama, I know he does it, because I'm on the bed, jumping out of bed, on your couch, Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a James Scott from Dave Chappelle, you look it up on the it's so funny. I think everybody would be saying it to the friends, only in an Irish accent, which sounds like singing to me. So, you guys, anytime you guys talk, it sounds nice, so it sounds like you're singing, even when I got yelled at on a boat by a drunk guy. <laughs> No, but uh, we had one of our friends, he took <laughs> That's what happens when you're in a band of people. They want to take care of you. We don't have to do it anymore. We used to have to do it. Well, he used to do it. I used to run my mouth and he would, he would back up my mouth. <laughs>